hi guys welcome and welcome back to my channel my name is miss nani as usual and of course i'm back here on your screen with a new video in case you're new here please subscribe to my channel make sure you hit the notification bell that is down there so that you can be notified every time when i have uploaded a new video and to my returning subscribers thank you for always coming back to see what i'm doing you know i like you guys yes and guys as you can see it has been a minute since i came here to do a video it's just because of ups and downs for work but of course today i've decided just because i got the time why not so why not come here to do a video with you guys you can see i'm having the cutest hairstyle ever guys i just love my hairstyle you guys can see it it's so unique and um, it's the cutest hairstyle i've come along lately i did not copy from anyone guys i just came up with it in mind and i just went to the salonist i told her you know what I want a hairstyle like this and this you have to do this and this and this i just want to look pretty and of course this is a hit guys this is not a miss she did the work so pretty and i'm so happy about it i know most of you are wondering how i go to work with this long hair i'm going to show you the different style i style my hair when i'm going to work just because i can't just go with the hair like this at work i won't look decent for a journalist it's not restricted for you to go to work with the hair like this but sometimes according to the meetings i do with the community you know guys i'm a community leader so when i'm doing my meetings i have to be very decent as possible another thing guys i did my nails you guys can see the nails oh my god they really look pretty i love them my silver rings you guys can see them they're so pretty and cute oh my god i love them yeah anyway let's come back to the purpose of me coming here to do this video today is my off day and i'm opting to go to the beach and then I thought that it's very important for me to show you guys the essential of every girl like the things that are so very much important for any girl when going to the beach so guys be with me stick here till the end of this video make sure you comment like let me know what you would like of all the things that i'll be carrying when going to the beach just let me know in case you feel like i forget anything these are very important for every girl to have when going out so let us start the video yes welcome be my guest to the end of this video okay let us start with my bag this is the best bag i'm having lately of which i love it just because it has enough space for me to carry everything that i want um i also like putting my laptop here it really have unique features that i've really been longing for yes and this is the bag now i'm going to use okay today i don't need a laptop just because i'm not going to do anything like it has nothing to do with me at the beach so I'm just going to carry things that are so important for me when I'm going to the beach. You guys know what this is. This is a Maasai Shuka. It is very long. I'm not going to unfold it right now. I'm going to carry this just because when I get tired, maybe tired of swimming or maybe even before I go to swim, I would love to have this for me to lay it down at the sand and i keep watching maybe when i'm doing my things i'll just be there seated i'm not going to sit at the sand it's very important for you guys another thing guys i need to carry are my bikini yes i'm going to carry this top for today and uh, the shorts 
Yes, if you're going to swim, you have to have bikini. That is obvious. No one goes to the beach without a bikini. Another thing I have to carry is my lera. You guys can see. Yeah, I know you will wonder why I carry a lera when going to the beach. So, I feel like the lera is the most important cloth that you all should be carrying when you're going to the beach. I like being free at the beach. I'm used to deras. I know there are those fancy beach dresses, but for me, just because I like dera, that's why I will opt to carry this. In case you don't like deras, you can opt to carry a shuka, any any lesser. Opt to carry it when you're done swimming. You just wrap it here. So that's how I do. But for me, but for today, I'm just going to carry this. You can also opt to carry those fancy beach dresses. When you're done swimming, you just put on your dress and you keep watching the beach and the sand. Yes, another thing I have to carry is this hat. I'm stuck between carrying this one. Let me see how they're going to look on me. Yeah, this one. I'm opting to have this one as well. Yeah, it's still cute. Whether I should also carry this one. Depends with the mood, but no, I don't... I just don't feel like carrying this one and this one. So let me just opt to carry this one. Yes, this one is the cutest one. I'm just going to carry this one. Hello, sunshine. You know, the reason is to why we carry hats when going to the beach, guys. It's not that we're going to slay the beach, no. I just don't like the direct contact with my skin, so I opt to carry this one. In case I feel the sun is too much, I will just do this way. The sun will not directly come to me. Uh, and for this, I have to match them with, this, with some sunnies yeah i just don't leave behind my sunnies when going to the beach when i carry the hat i have to carry this one as a backup as well um <clears throat> yes let me just fold this and put it inside my bag yeah we are packing guys remember that we are packing for my beach day and this i have to carry my notebook this book i was gifted by lamu youth alliance it's an organization for women, so they gifted me this book after hosting them in my, my radio show. When I'm seated in my Maasai Shuka at the sandy beach, you know, I will just have content flowing. I will write my diary, so I have to carry my book when going to the beach. And I know most of people prefer writing using their phone. There is that phone book app in your phone, but for me... I feel good when writing. I just feel like the content flows well when I'm writing using a book and a paper. Yeah, that's why I don't use my phone book to write notes. If you like that, let me know in the comment section, guys. Another thing I have to carry is this bottle. For this bottle, I bought it at Java. You guys can see Java, Java House. Yes. Um. For this, I love it just because I'm going to carry my cold water and the water is going to remain cold until the time I'm out of that place. And again, if I put warm thing here, it also remains to be warm until I finish. So I'm just going to pack it, but I will remove it later just because I will need to put some cold water here. Yes. Another thing I'm going to carry, guys, is this. Whites. Just because I don't have other ones, I will carry my house whites. Yes. Yeah, when you're going somewhere, as a lady, just carry whites. It's very important. And this. What are these guys? Snacks. When you're going for a beach, guys, you know, most of the time there are no hotels near the. There are no hotels near the beach, and if there are hotels near the beach. Most of them are very expensive. Even the snacks they sell at the beach, they are so much expensive. I prefer carrying my snacks when going to the beach alone. I prefer carrying my snacks. I just have this package in my room right now. But when I'm going out, I will go and add some, some other, yes. You know, I like carrying a lot of snacks. In case I don't finish them when I'm there at the beach, I'll just have to come with them in my house and they will be so helpful to me. Every time I need, I like snacks. Another thing, guys, I don't leave behind is this. This is my makeup bag. Simply not even my makeup bag. Every time, even when I'm going to the office, I need this. And for any lady, you just need a bag where you can put your essential. There are those small things 
the small two things that you need to carry let me show you what i put here for this bag i put my sunscreen i'm using sunscreen from dr rashil products another thing this is not a necessity guys this is mascara i i really use it most of the time but like for now i've not even applied it you guys can see but it's very important it stays here in my bag another thing i have to carry is this in case i'm having dry lips i just use this lip gloss another thing i have to carry guys is this i store this in my bag these are pant liners in case i need some I have to as a lady why would you miss the pant liners uh, another thing guys this do you know what these are these are tampons <clears throat> these are tampons they play the same role with pads they're just like sanitary towels the pads i prefer like i just prefer these over pads another thing i have to carry in this bag is this yeah it's almost finishing you guys can see it just have lately but this one is a perfume of which acts like a backup. Of course, I have to perfume myself before getting my, before getting out of my house. I refill them from top time. Yeah, the top time shops, you just go and refill one that will just act as a backup, that you just carry it anywhere you're going. Those are the things that I don't like missing in this bag, guys. And it's a very nice bag. It's a big one. In case you need other things, the small things you can just place in this bag. But for me, I just carry those. Another thing, guys, I need to carry this. Who knows what this is? Mm, the light. The light is firing. Yeah, you guys can see. This one is a boob tip. Uh, lately, I'm not bra friendly. I'm using boob tips. Let me tell you the importance of having this, guys. Okay, let me explain this in Kiswahili. English is not my tongue. So... <laughs> Let me try my best to balance English and Kiswahili. So, wakati umenda kwa beach na umevaa bikini, guys. Kuna wakati unafika, bikini yako imejichora, like your whole body is visible. In case, ile bikini yako imepata maji, mwili yako imejichora, boobs yako azitaonekana just because you have this. And having this, I prefer carrying this as well. This, this, the scissors. I also carry scissors, like almost every place I go. I have these ones. They are very portable for my bag. Like anytime I can put them anywhere in my bag. So do you know what are these for? Cutting the boob tape. This one will help you cut the boob according to the size that you have. Very unfortunate. I just have this small roll. So for this you'll just cut your size using your scissor. Then you're just going to fix them. That's why it's very important to carry scissors as well. Another thing I use these. This one act as a weapon. Let me tell you, my dear girls, when you're having this one, it's very useful for you. Just because if someone does something that is wrong to you, you don't know how many people are just going to come and harm you. You can use this. Like, anyway, that is a secret. I also use this to cut my hair. In case I'm having bad hair, I, just, I will just, maybe my hair has something bad. I just cut them. Even my cloth, maybe something happens to my cloth, I will just cut that part. Yeah, that is very important. Another thing is this, my tumbler. For this, I will just use to carry my juice. And for this, I don't put inside my bag just because it can leak anytime. It has a hole here up. So I just carry it using my bag. Uh, I just carry it using my arms. It's very important. Guys, I really love this. Tumblr. I I bought it from Simple Life in Nairobi and it's so sexy like everyone likes it so I also love it it looks so girlish and it's very good for a baby girl yeah I'm, I'm ready to go guys my bag is fully packed ready for me like waiting for my time to go to the beach and I'm so proud that I managed to show you the things that are very much important for a lady when she is going outside to beach maybe nature walk 
those are the very important things that you're supposed to carry and my journey is ready to set off guys thank you so much guys for watching my video it will have been a good moment to have this with you i have really been longing to do this so like my video you know the more you like my video the more youtube will recommend people to watch my video so don't leave without liking and in case you think i forgot anything or maybe in case there's something that you like carrying when you're going out let me know in the comment section guys and in case you have a question as well let me know in the comment section it was a good vlog with you guys thank you so much see you next time in the next vlog bye bye